basically this is going to be my going away vlog it'll be my last vlog before i enter into the navy service and uh yeah i'm uh, pretty excited pretty nervous uh i'm really just kind of hanging in there as far as the whole pre-boot camp thing goes it's been a crazy journey these past couple years and uh, i'm really glad you guys stuck with me but this is certainly not the end it's actually a new beginning both uh, for me as well as a new beginning for my blog my vlogs all sorts of things yeah i hope to uh, continue making videos even while i'm in the service as well as when i get out i hope you guys continue to watch my vlogs read my blog I hope you guys uh, still are subscribed to my channel by the time I come back because uh, there's going to be some new stuff, um, a, new life in a new life in series. The blog and vlogs are just going to totally kick off. I see my battery's running kind of low, uh, so I guess I better uh, end things here. This is the Amisan signing off for the last time here in Salina, Ohio. And as always, we'll see you next time. Bye, guys. Alright, guys. So I'm finally at the Narita Airport. And uh, I'm about to dig in on my last piece of uh, beef curry. Curry rice here in the States. A nice Asahi brew going on. And I'm just going to dig in here and show you guys around. The gate that I'm going to be going at. So, yeah. Check it out. Last little... A little trip here through Narita for a while. So, see where I go from here. So, in the next little bit, I will show you guys the Seattle airport. So, yeah, see you there. All right, guys. So, after about a week and some change stay here at uh, Bangor Base in lovely Washington State here in America, um, I'm officially. Uh, a veteran now, so I'm no longer a part of the uh, United States Navy, officially discharged as of today, September 24th, 2015. Woo. So yeah, this is going to get a little bit longer, and this is going to get a little bit smaller, you know. So those are my goals for uh, for my vet status and all that stuff. So um, right now I'm just waiting on the bus to take me to the airport, where I'm going to fly out of Seattle and uh, to... North Carolina. I think I'm landing in either Raleigh or Charlotte. I'm not sure yet. But um, going from there to Dayton, Ohio, and then back home to lovely Salina, Ohio. So yeah, like I said, got my bags packed right here, and I'm just uh, just waiting on the bus to take me to the airport. So uh, in the next little bit, I'll show you around uh, lovely Seattle airport. So yeah, see you there. So yeah, I'm just sitting here at the uh, USO here at the uh, Seattle Tacoma Airport, and uh, I'm just working on some videos and stuff like that and uh, I just finished um, one of them so I'm gonna start up on another one because I still have a couple hours left to burn before uh, I gotta get checked in and you know fly out so I'm just kinda sitting chilling here at the USO and uh, stuff like that so in the next little bit I'm gonna show you around the uh, boarding area for my flight from Seattle to uh, Charlotte, North Carolina, and from Charlotte to Dayton, and from Dayton to home in lovely Salina, Ohio. So yeah, see you in the next bit. Alright guys, so I'm here at the uh, airport all checked in and everything, so I'm uh, going to be boarding here in about 10-20 uh, minutes, so I just want to show you guys around uh, Seattle Tacoma Airport, so see you in the next bit. Okay, so we're about ready to board right, right down there, and uh, and the, uh, the chili's closed, so I couldn't get my drink on, sadly. So I just went and got some stuff over at the uh, little convenience store area over there. So I came around this way. And they got these little tables where you can set up your devices and charge them and stuff. So it's, and they got them over there too. So it's, it's actually a pretty cool idea. Not too bad. So, yeah. There we go. And, uh, the next little bit will be in the uh, Charlotte airport, so we'll see you then. Alright guys, so uh, yeah, no footage of uh, North Carolina airport, but uh, I had to pretty much uh, roll like right away into boarding like as soon as I landed, so didn't have time to uh, really do anything, didn't have time to grab coffee or nothing, so I am 
dragging all kinds of possible ass this morning, so apologies for that. But uh, we're here in lovely Dayton, so uh, just gonna go downstairs, get my bags, meet with the fam, and get the fuck home. So yeah, see you the next bit. Smooth. So yeah, welcome to the uh, season finale of Andy Japandi. And uh, I'm back home here in lovely Salina, Ohio, at my parents' place. Uh, it's good to see friends and family again. And uh, I've just been, you know, taking some time, as you could tell from all the scruff, to uh, really reflect on uh, my time in Japan, my almost about two and a half years or so out there, as well as my five and a half years in the uh, U.S. Navy. And uh, I've taken some time to really think about what I want to say. And it's just been, uh, it's just been an incredible journey, you know, over these past couple of years. And, you know, I've definitely grown as a person. And, uh, you know, the, the whole Andy Japandi series was something that I've wanted to do pretty much ever since I started YouTube, really. Um, you know, all those years ago, watching guys like Tokyo Kuni, watching, you know, Tokyo Swan and, you know, their you know, others out there. Uh, those are the main two. But uh, there's a lot of other original J-vloggers that I watched back then who've kind of inspired me to, you know, come out to Japan one day and make those kinds of videos. And, you know, I'm glad to say that I, I've done that. And, you know, of course there's places out in Japan that I've wanted to see that I didn't get a chance to uh, during my first run out there. But, you know, there's always next time. <laughs> And I've been kind of teasing that as well. Um, but I am glad for the, you know, very uh, thankful, I guess you could say, of the time that I did spend out there in Japan and of what I did get to see and of the people that I did get to meet. You know, I've met YouTubers that I've been, you know, watching for years. And I've also met up with some new up-and-coming YouTubers as well. So it's been a good mix of the two. And it's, it's just been great, you know. But, um... For now, the whole Japan experience is over. Um, do I plan on coming back to Japan? Uh, it's, it's still a little too early to say. Um, you know, I'm thinking about maybe doing like a student exchange or something like that while I'm in college. But, you know, if that's not possible, then, you know, maybe just waiting until after I graduate to, you know, maybe do like the JET program or just, you know, try to find a job out in Japan, maybe. Um, I'm not really sure at this point. Uh, it's... Still too early to say, but uh, I do want to come back, come back to Japan in some capacity. Maybe, maybe not to live, but you know, maybe to visit every once in a while. So you know, just to meet up with my old friends again, and you know, see things that I didn't get to see during my uh, first run there. So um, yeah, it's kind of kind of bittersweet seeing the. Uh, the Andy Japandi series come to an end for now. Like I said, I do definitely want to come back, but uh, nothing's really set in stone as of yet, so it's it's hard to say. So um, I'm sure you guys are probably wondering, you know, well, Andy, now that you're back in America, are you gonna continue to make videos? You know, where you're at? Of course. You know, I've been doing this whole YouTube thing for almost ten years now, and. At the time of this recording, I don't have any plans of stopping anytime soon. So uh, yeah, of course I'm gonna, you know, continue to make uh, you know videos of my time here in the states, um, showing off different areas of not only my hometown here in Salina, but also when I go up to uh, Kalamazoo, Michigan, to go to Western Michigan University for college. You know, I definitely wanna show some stuff up there. You know, maybe talk about my life as a now a veteran and just kind of looking back on my time in the US Navy from a veteran's perspective rather than somebody who's you know active duty so I definitely want to definitely want to continue making videos I have no plans to stop in anytime soon and if I ever do reach that point where I'm like you know I just want to hang it up I'm kinda of done with YouTube or whatever then you know I definitely will make a video letting you guys know because I figure you know it's really the least I can do you know, it's just common courtesy, you know. I don't want to just one day stop making videos, so. But, I digress. So, yeah, this is uh, the end of the Andy Japandi series, for now. So, with that said, this is the Andy-san. Sign up for now, thinking you guys, poop.
for tuning in to my Andy Japani series and uh, for watching my other stuff as well as my uh, Navy related videos and things like that. And I also want to thank you guys for liking with the thumbs, commenting, subscribing, send a few friends to the party. And hey, as always, we'll see you next time. Catch you later, guys. Bye. Looks like we ain't in San Diego anymore, huh?